Hi everyone, this is Heather from WeddingsByHeather.com. In this video, we're going to learn how to create a new catalog inside of Lightroom. If you haven't already, please watch my free video series available on my website as I detail my workflow. Essentially, I create two new catalogs per year, one for clients, and one for my personal images. So at the end of the year, which it is right now, the end of 2014, I'm gonna go ahead and create new catalogs for 2015. Inside of Lightroom, all you need to do is go to File, New Catalog. We're gonna choose a location to save this catalog. So I'm gonna to go to my Photography Volume, my 2015 images, and I'm gonna start with my clients. And if you've watched those videos on my workflow, then this is making sense. And if you haven't, I have this all outlined um, even in a printable. So you can see why I've structured it this way, but I'm not going to spend time in this video recapping that. What I'm going to do is create a catalog that I'm going to name 2015 clients. I want to be very clear on the name of this catalog. I'm going to choose create. Lightroom needs to close the catalog that I currently have open because it can only have one catalog open at a time. I have it set up in my preferences to ask me if I would like to back up my catalog upon exiting. I'm going to go ahead and say skip this time. And Lightroom created my new empty catalog ready for import for my 2015 client images. Let's go ahead and create another catalog for our personal photographs. I'm going to go to file, new catalog. Again, I'm going to choose my photography volume, my 2015 images. This time I'm going to go into my personal folder and create a catalog named 2015 personal. I like to be very clear with these names so that there isn't any confusion. And once you click create, Lightroom again will close that current catalog and open the new one. And that's all there is to it. You now have two new catalogs created on your hard drive. For me, this is my external hard drive. Let's go ahead and jump over to Finder so that you can see what this looks like. Under 2015 images, I have my clients. I have them organized by month. And then there is a folder for my Lightroom catalog called 2015 clients. And there's the catalog. And if we go back and look at my personal images, you'll notice the same thing. And there are my 2015, there is my 2015 personal catalog. I hope that you found this useful. If you require more detail beyond the workflow explanation that I provide in my free video series, please subscribe to my membership site. Thank you.